Hi guys, and welcome to the first video on this channel in a very long time. And I know, I know, probably you guys were thinking I forgot about you or something, but that, that's not true. I was just really, really busy with a lot of stuff, and uh, I'm going to put out a video today. So today, I'm going to talk about a PvP server called Pride PvP. It's uh, a PvP server, obviously, with uh, griefing, scamming, all that good stuff. And, uh... I was really drawn to it just for that aspect of it, and I'm just going to show you my little pad here. So basically, everyone can form what is called a faction, and in your faction you have land that you can claim, and nobody else can destroy it except you, unless they have TNT. Now, they can't put TNT on your property, but they can build a cannon off your property, launch it onto your property, and blow into your base. And that's one of my favorite method methods of uh, griefing other people's houses and stealing all their things. Now, originally, I played this server hardcore and collected a bunch of stuff myself. And then I got raided, and it was really shitty. So I said, fuck it, fuck collecting anything, I'm just gonna steal everything of everyone else's. So I went around griefing, stealing, raiding with uh, my friend Kyle and his friend Jonah. And foreseeably some of my other friends might join in the future. Uh, it might be pretty fun. And anyway, uh, this is all stolen stuff, by the way. And this is a secret base, so I can't show you the coordinates to it because I don't want it to get raided. But anyway, it's hidden very, very well. And uh, we're just going to take a look at around some chests. That's my moss stone chest. This is the room. I haven't even... I don't even know what this room is for yet. Uh... This is sort of my shitty treasure room, where, uh, netherrack, that should be up here. Apparently, like, when you go to the nether in this game, and you try to go, oh, fucking chunk errors, man, I hate chunk errors. Yeah, it's under the ocean. But, uh, fuck, when he clicks all the nether stuff in the nether, and then you come back, your inventory resets. Like, you lose everything. So the only way you can get this is by buying it from the store at the spawn point. And, uh, this is my cobble, uh, dirt and gravel, leather armor, wooden tools, more wooden tools, iron armor, this one's enchanted, fire protection, uh, iron tools and ingots, I got quite a few of those, uh, stone tools, Redstone, some sticky pistons. These are pretty hard to come by on this game because uh, the slime balls are really, really kind of rare because slimes are don't really spawn. You have to buy it from the store, I think. And uh, this is my bones. And as you can see, not a lot here. And there's a fucking chunk air one. Second. Okay, we're back, and hopefully it won't chunk air for another five minutes. Anyway, as we get over here, this is my garbage disposal thing. If you will excuse me again. Uh, this is my chicken farm. Where all my chickens lay eggs. And as you can see, I like to store the eggs here. My enchantment table. Oh yeah, you might notice the floor is lapis. Because I raided so much stuff. And this is the farm. It sustains us. And this is the main room. And these are actually anvils. Because there's a plug-in for the server called MCMMO. And it gives you... Uh, like MMO type skills, like swords, uh, fists, like gathering skills, and repair skills. So if you right click with an item, like a, say I have a damaged iron sword, right click on this thing with iron ingot in my inventory and it will repair it. And apparently you get more efficient with it later. Uh, this is my bucket collection. Uh, lava is very cool to grief with because you can fill people's bases with lava and then dump water on it and fill it with cobble and that's kind of fun. <laughs> uh, plants and shit. Uh, yeah. Craftables, this is just a bunch of stuff. Like, keep in mind, all this is stolen. and Not a lot of people bother to pick up these things over here, but I like collecting them for whatever reason. Uh, food. <laughs> I stole, like, so much rotten flesh. I don't know why people have these. Probably, like, zombie spawners somewhere. Uh, let's check over here. Wood. People like to keep wood, so... That's all the wood. Uh, more cobble. Uh, string, wool, snow, and sand. Oh, yeah, and all of these furnaces are, like, full of, like, I'm making stone to sell it in the store as a method of cash because I'm pretty poor. I only have, like, 2.4k. More stone. 
and uh, coal, stone stuff, bricks. And uh, that's my roof. There's some nice gold plates in there. It's very nice detail. Because I have so much of this shit now, I just like to put it. Like, I'm going to put a lapis floor in. I'm going to put gold patterns on the roof. Glowstone around the edges, very nice. Anyway, this is my rare one. Uh, look at all these stacks of diamonds. If you ever play a PvP server, you might know how hard it is to get diamonds. Like, so this is actually quite a few bases that I raided. Uh, these are a lot of obsidian blocks. I didn't bother to make the walls out of this base obsidian because people, like, it's not a perfect PvP server. There is, like, glitches. Like, people, like, no-clip through things sometimes. That's how my first base got raided. Somebody no-clipped through it, which really, really sucks. But, yeah, so fuck it. I'm just going to raid everything. And this server will be reset for version 1.3, which is 1st of August, I think. So, uh, you might want to join then, because everyone will have a fresh start. No advantages, no disadvantages. God damn, that's a lot of eggs. I could just fill somebody's house with egg or chickens. And that'd be hilarious. But yeah, it's uh, pretty nice. We're doing pretty good. It's probably worth quite a bit because it's a very secret location. So uh, I hope it won't get raided. It's camouflaged. And uh, you can probably tell by the way the roof looks with all these little drops. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a lot of cool stuff. Oh, and the last chest I want to show you is my armor and other cool shit. So we raided, like, all of these. Like, I don't think we even made diamond tools. And uh, this pick here is unbreaking. This one's, like, unbreaking 3 and efficiency 4. And for some reason, somebody had a bunch of sets of gold armor and, like, enchanted stuff. If I repair enchanted stuff, it, like, turns to regular diamond. So I don't want to waste it. And we found strength potions. I don't really have potion figured it out yet, but I'll probably get there with this thing. And I'm also wearing a set of diamond armor. So, before I finish this video, just I'm just showing you my pad right now. I'll maybe show some griefing clips later. That'd be pretty fun, I think. Uh, I'll just show you it in a different texture pack, just because I love my texture packs. Be right back. And this is LB's photorealism. And as you see, the wheat looks pretty badass. This is my favorite one for the walls because it makes the uh, rock look a little nicer. Bedrock. And uh, the lapis looks really nice. Um, man, that thing doesn't even make sense. I don't even know what this is supposed to be. Apparently I make potions with it. But yeah, the gold looks almost the same as the glowstone, so it sort of defeats the purpose of the detail. And this is Misa's uh, texture pack. Hers is pretty popular. Lapis is tiled, which... Sort of goes well. I love the glowstone in this one. Uh, I don't like how the beds look all militarized. It's pretty neat. Lava looks pretty weak. The books don't look very colorful. They don't look colorful on a lot of these texture packs. And that's about all I have to show you for right now. So uh, let me know if you want to see some griefing clips because it's pretty fun. Uh, man, there's one time we raided this one base and they actually came home as I was raiding it. Like they logged in and shit. <laughs> uh, it was hilarious. But yeah, the last base we raided, which was like an hour ago, we got five stacks of diamond from them which is pretty nuts. Anyway, that's it. Don't want to make this video crazy long, even though it probably already is. See you later.